What should you look for in your next job, right? It's not the corner office. It's not the title of position. They all help, right? With superficial level of importance and a little bit of ego stroking, but they don't matter. Because if you're a true leader and true visionary, someone who really is going to help that business and drive it forward, you're not gonna spend that much time in your office. I tell you that, number one, right? Number one. Number two, when you do, it's often to close your door to either have a quick lunch, which is not a good thing, but it happens, or to review, review contracts or have personal confidential conversations with their employees, vendors, partners, and so forth. And for all of those, it doesn't really matter where your office is. It doesn't have to be visible, it does not have to be massive, it does not have to be at a corner with a lot of windows. Two, title, position. Yes, in your corporate ranking means something, but then again, it doesn't. Um, a friend of mine and I have both noticed that in some industries, you know, certain positions are prevalent and they don't carry as much weight. In higher education, a vice president is a position that is within the leadership team, within the cabinet. In finance, it might not be. I know a lot of folks who, you know, are pretty much VPs of their floors, right? They work in this building that has 80 floors and, you know, there's like 90 VPs in that, in that, in that office, in that location. That doesn't make sense either. So don't worry about the corner office. Don't worry about the position and title. Worry about your influence and visibility. Here's what I mean. Figure out what the business is all about. You should know that, right, when you're applying. What is the core purpose? What is the mission of that business? Besides making money, because that's not a mission, right? Why is that business in existence? What does it do and why, right? Get as close as you can to that. Be good at delivering that value, and you can't lose. You're going to get everything else that you want subsequently. The money, the raises, the bonuses, the promotions, the office, the title, company car, expense card, and so forth. If that is what drives you, if that is what you're focused on, which are all the wrong things, focus on delivering value. Come in, get stuff done. Lead people, inspire them, motivate them. Do more than the person who was there before you and get everybody else around to do more than they've done before your arrival. That's how you win. Don't worry about positions, titles, and so forth. Yes, it's part of the negotiations, and yes, you have to address them at some point, but that cannot be your driving force, your guiding force, your North Star, because in that instance, every single time, you're going to lose. Have a wonderful day. Wish you all the best. Share this video with someone who's currently looking to change jobs or careers, perhaps even industries, and let me know what you think should be the focus of those who are looking to advance and grow within their professional realms. You have a wonderful day.